the Lord himself will give you a sign. The virgin will be with child and will give birth to a son and will call him Emmanuel. She was growing into a teenager and was living then in the obscure village of Nazareth in Galilee. She gathered the grain during the day and tended the lamp laid into the watches of the night. Her father knew the dedication of her work, her mother the kindness of her heart, her friends the curve of her smile. She stood on the threshold of womanhood. Among all the girls in the village, she had been noticed, chosen, betrothed, a child bride before whom lay only possibility. Her father could walk with pride in the city gates, her mother could rest in the comfort of her daughter's future security. But then he came, unexpected, unannounced, spoke openly and without shame of pregnancy, virginity, and a son. Things men never discussed, and women only whispered about behind closed doors. She questioned him about the particulars, but not about the promise. She knew the prophecies, and the angel's words rang true. She would be scorned and rejected, labeled an adulteress in whispers and glances. There would be no more carefree walks to the market, no more happy trips to the well. Four hundred years her people had waited for hope, but God had been silent. Now he had spoken. The wait was about to end. Forty weeks, and then... Emmanuel, God with us.